welcome to Knock Row Nation. Welcome back, guys. Jarrell here. Hey, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Josh. We're here to talk about Fear of the Walking Dead Season 7, Episodes 9 through 15, Synopsis. Well, Synopsis for what? Two of them? Two of them. And titles for the rest. And titles that were just yeah. recently revealed for the rest. Yeah. So um, we are... Uh, it, it's interesting. Both Fear of the Walking Dead and The Walking Dead... You know, this Fear has released all their titles already. The Walking Dead for Part B barely even gave us titles they you know I, or they gave us titles and no synopsis which yeah you kind of don't really want to because it will kind of spoil stuff and we but will get nothing for the final we'll season. get nothing yeah so um the final episode i i doubt depending on how it goes i doubt they'll probably release the title for it or synopsis because it probably might say too much depending on what it is so we're gonna go through these we're gonna read the synopsis for the first two episodes and then just give our thoughts on the titles themselves so yeah, let's do all it. Right, it um, episodes uh, nine. Follow me. Alicia takes refuge in a home of mysterious stranger with her fellow uh, with her fevers growing worse and Arno pursuing her in every turn. Alicia is forced to confront the failings of her past and how she will face her future. Yeah. Arno is in the mix as yep. we as we've talked about in our previous videos. But it yep. um, obviously got clarification on that. Yep. So I think that's kind of what the the teaser that we recently reacted to and broke down. I think that's kind of what a lot of it is, is her, um, you know, reflecting on her fever, having these visions. Uh, we think in one of those shots that we did in our breakdown, she is captured by Arno. So I think or he's pursuing her. She, he captures her and then whatever happens and an alliance, you know, maybe an alliance forms because yeah. they both want the tower. So maybe she gets some more help. Yep. So yeah, see how that goes. Uh, episode 10, Morning Cloak. When Charlie shows up at the tower unexpectedly, Howard recruits a young ranger in training to determine the reason for her visit. As they journey beyond the tower together, Charlie's true motives are revealed. So guys, uh, when Josh was on vacation, I did the reaction and breakdown of the 7B trailer, and there is a shot in there which shows potentially Charlie getting a love interest, and it probably is that young ranger trained to be with her. So, and when you get a love interest, <laughs> your time is someone limited. will die. <laughs> your time is limited. Yes. Finally, the day has come, ladies and gentlemen. If you've been watching our videos for a long time, I have wanted this person to die. He wants her gone big time. <laughs> <laughs> and guess who's coming back? Madison. And guess who's not going to deal with her being around? Madison. Well, if if you think she's gonna so die, gonna in, if you think she's gonna die in this season, probably not. Depending on how they bring Madison back, if they just bring her back in flashbacks to show how she escaped the stadium, and then in season eight where we get her, we'll have to wait and see how. It All goes. I'm saying is she <laughs> dies before Madison comes back with full force. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next All right, one. Season. Um, wow, I keep saying season. Um, episode eleven. Uh, so from now, from here until fourteen, we only have the titles. Or well, even the even fifteen. That fifteen, I just have some. You have notes just underneath some notes that. Underneath yeah. That. So the episode eleven is Ophelia. Oh my God, uh, Danielle. Yes. Oh, it's, we asked for it. It's a uh, it's a scary episode title too. It's scary. Who is the one? Um, Ophelia's death was really hard for him because he yeah. didn't actually get to witness it. He was who a part. Who was the one yeah. that that caused that? Was it Madison? She made it to Brokejaw Ranch. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. Because she oh, that's infiltrated right. yeah. Brokejaw yeah, Ranch. She did. Yeah, she did. She um, died shortly after that, I thought. Yeah, um, she was bit. But he blamed someone for not giving him not giving him that moment of being with her. And I can't remember who it was. I Yeah. Gosh, I want to say it was Madison. He was there at the end, but she was basically died. She I think she either already died or he said a couple words and then he, she died in his yeah. arms. So, but he yeah. blamed someone for that. Right. Um, but anyway, yeah, guys, obviously going to be heavily uh, a Daniel episode, and we look forward to that one. Yeah. So I think um, I think I mentioned that I haven't mentioned. It. I think I looked it up on the Wikipedia fandom wiki, and I'll put it on screen. Uh, I think this is the first time in Fear the Walking Dead that they've used the t title of our one of our characters as a title. Sorry, I think I said that in wrong. In fear or in, altogether? In fear. Um, they've used other mentions of characters in titles but it, they've never used the main character in a title i think this is the first one so i'll find that on the wiki and i'll throw it on the screen so all right episode 12 sunny boy now when i read this do you know what immediately i thought of huh i was like 
is this going to be a Dwight episode? I don't know why I think of Dwighty Boy with Sonny Boy. Oh, well, Dwighty Boy. You know what I mean? I just don't know why. Like, I think that would be something Negan would say. What's yeah. up, Sonny Boy? You, like, know, <laughs> you know, now that you I know? just think about this, because, um, so not to gloss over yours, but the next one is called The Raft. Mm-hmm. And that's the that's the photos that we get of, that we've recently reviewed. Mm-hmm. And you know how I talked to you about, hey, it seems like by this time, with all of our characters out, Mm-hmm. that the tower stuff is over with right so a couple episodes in so they just might be to bring gone. that back to ophelia maybe yeah. ophelia is the episode where the tower goes down maybe doesn't go down but gets defeated maybe yeah right and it, however story they do with daniel it would calling make, it ophelia maybe my thinking of the person that daniel was mad about was not madison but strand maybe. with the ophelia situation <laughs> maybe i can't we'll remember i'll have to look that up but anyway yeah just ophelia I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna take a prediction that uh, episode eleven we're done with the tower. Mm, gotcha, Sunny Boy. Yeah, can't really think of anything right now. I just think of Dwight for some reason. We'll find out. Yeah, no, nothing. Yeah. To, no no information on this guys. Yep. The raft, like I said, we've seen pictures of them going to this. I don't know if it's an island, but they're crossing you know waters in rafts, and, yeah. and obviously that's. It's down related. in Texas, so I'm, I imagine it's a probably a lake yeah, or, or something. a river. Yeah, a river or something like that. Uh, episode 14, uh, Divine Providence. So uh, Divine Providence. Yeah, that's um, I think some I think the whole tower thing is going to be over with. I think, um, you know, Divine Providence is kind of gives you that Padre ish, Padre ish, you know, maybe reflect reflection, things like that. You is know, Padre gonna, an island. There is a Padre Island, yes, but uh, they're not going to put, kind of what Will said, they're not going to put a secret location close to a known source like that, so. <laughs> but everything is pointing to them going to an island. Rafts? Kind of. Yeah, the raft. I don't know. Could be. Could be on an island, just not Padre Island. Yeah. Yeah. So. All right. Episode 15 is Amina. Amina. Yep. Yep. Uh, guys, just note this is the hundred episode milestone, and uh, with the information that Jarrell is going to read off here and give you a uh, strong belief that this will be Madison's return in this episode. Yeah, guys. So if you don't remember, the Amina is short for Wilhelmina or Wilhelmina, <laughs> uh, also known as Amina. Um, it is a bird that was mentioned in in the In Fear the Walking Dead. She's a former pet of Alicia and Nick. So. During a vacation in the mountains, uh, Amina crashed through the windows of the house the Clark family was staying at. Both Alicia and Nick nursed it back to health after it broke its wings and even putting alarms up to take care of the bird and stuff like that. So they kept it in a shoebox. It got better. They decided to fly around the living room. Um, it's unknown if they ever took it back to Los Angeles after the vacation or left it there. Uh, it was also mentioned in season four, episode eight, No One's Gone, in a flashback when Al met Madison, when she was telling her of her children were young, they nursed back, you know, the bird to health, blah, blah, blah. She says that her, here's a big piece of it. She says that her children's determination to save the bird was a trait that they still possessed. And that is absolutely true. Then later on in the flashback, Al writes on the tape, Amina because she likes to keep her tape and that's when she gave madison a buck, bunch of ramen packages that's how yep. ramen got in there and then uh, after that event that's when madison finds alicia nick strand and luciana after the events of the dam and they all go to the stadium and then season four is debacle uh after that <laughs> ensues, <laughs> ensues. <laughs> so um, yeah I, yeah yeah i think she's coming back you on don't that have that type of title without bringing madison back yeah there's no point yeah and leaving 716 title out I don't know what they want to hide from not giving that up, but they're hiding something. Dude, that's going to be called Padre. <laughs> <laughs> they already had actually they already had an episode called Padre, so they can't oh, use they it did? twice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 when we first found out about Padre. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah, that was actually Alicia's episode when she lost her hand too. So, um yeah, 716, very mysterious. Who knows what they're going to call it if they can't release that title right now? Why not? They're ridiculous. Just give us the title. Just give us the title. Yeah. Like, I mean, we could say, oh, 7-Eleven is spoilery. It's called Ophelia. So people are going to be like, oh, Daniel's going to die. Something bad's going to happen to it's, Daniel. Like, you know, it's not like uh, you haven't spoiled anything else for us in the world of The Walking Dead. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> like, right? I know. You can't give us a freaking title. You know what's funny is that they really don't spoil a ton of stuff on the fear side. 
No, you're right. They, they don't. They really don't. Yeah. Walking Dead side. They don't need to. Let's do it. That's because everyone's watching. You <laughs> I know, know. I don't know. get me wrong. It's, it's a the, lot of people the main, watching Fear. It's the but, main series. Yeah. yeah. So. Guys, yeah, these are some great titles, good information. Uh, definitely stay tuned. If they do release the synopsis for these, we'll definitely do videos to talk about them. But I have a feeling they're not going to. I think they're just going to have the synopsis for the first two. The rest, I think, if they do re reveal those early, I think it will give spoiler information that they don't want out, kind of what they've done with The Walking Dead. So, uh, And then once they do reveal the title, if they reveal 716, look for a tweet. Make sure you you know follow us on Twitter. Yeah. Um, We'll probably do a video, depending on how, what it is, we could do a video talking about it. Uh, just really depends if they reveal it. Yep. So once again, we are super excited. April 17th, stay tuned for videos, reactions from us on fear. And we will see you guys next time. I'm Jarrell. I'm Josh. We're not We're, We're out. out.